Just want to say welcome back to another video to all my LV besties. Um, as you can tell, I don't feel good. I woke up in the middle of the night and I had dizziness. Just excuse my husband. They're him and my daughter are trying to get things um, onto into the car to move and stuff. Anyways, I woke up in the middle of the night with to go to the bathroom and the dizziness hit me. Um, what I have is an inner ear infection. I've had this condition since I was 17 years old and it causes vertigo, which is dizziness. And basically what it is, is your equilibrium is off balance. And there's a couple things that can happen. One, you can have just fluid on your ears, which can cause your equilibrium to be off balance. Or two, you can have like what is called positional vertigo, where you wake up and it's and you're dizzy and it's because um, there's little crystals that are floating in your inner ear and those crystals can stick together and until they break apart then it causes your equilibrium to be off because they're supposed to just float inside your inner ear and if they stick together and like go to one side or the other your whole equilibrium is off okay so i feel like i have fluid on my ears because i've had a, my allergies have been really bad and it's usually what it is is fluid on my inner ear so um, i just want to get, get on here and let you guys know because I, I was supposed to do a video when and do my giveaway today but unless i get better i doubt i'm going to i am setting up in bed and filming with my phone and the only reason i'm doing that able to do that is because you guys i am taking it's over the counter. It's called Meclizine. And it's an antimatic to help like the nausea. But you guys, even though it says on there it's non drowsy, it I've been taking this since I was 17 years old. Mm -mm, it's not non drowsy for me. It knocks me out for the majority of the day. So I have today rode with my husband while we went to look at house plans. Miserable. But we had to go do it because like we got to get we got to get going on that and we had to go actually just like say like the final yes or no so that he can finish the house plans from all the changes we made which we said yes everything looked good so that, thank goodness we we're done with that he's going to finish them he's going to give them to our builder and we're going to move further with that but anyways i had to go do that so like i was like half asleep while looking at them however that wasn't a big deal because i mean i could still tell that it was going to be fine. I know my phone's kind of shaking and, and because it's weird holding my arm out and filming this long. But anyways, so besides that, I've been laying here in bed. And yeah, but so I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get on tonight and do the giveaway. Because it's all going to, going to depend on after this magazine wears off. If I'm not dizzy. And if I'm sorry, I know my, this video is awful. I have an unboxing today. So if I'm not dizzy, I will get on here and do the unboxing and do the giveaway. But if not, it I, it may be tomorrow. And you guys, another thing about this virus is it's viral. So there's no um, antibiotic that can help me. So it can last one day. It can last three. It can last a week. It can last a month. Most of the time, mine lasts either 24 hours or like a week usually there's no like in between like it's either the 24 hours or it's a long time one one time i can recall it having it about a month and there is a few things you can you can go get done and one thing is called a maneuver where they take and like like throw you back on the bed twist your head all these different directions and I, as a matter of fact, when I worked in NT as a nurse, I used to do those on people to help them. So you can do that. But I don't like to have it done because it makes me very sick to my stomach. And two, I, I just would rather ride it out, to be honest with you. Because at this point, basically, that really is all you can do. And that only helps if you have crystals out of line, okay? So, if you don't have the crystals out of line, you just have fluid on your ear, the maneuvers is not going to work. So, I could go get a steroid shot and that might would help like the fluid on my ears, which I have done many times in the past. If it lasts longer than a day or so, then, then I'll go get like a steroid shot. But at this point, I'm just going to ride it out and hopefully be better by like tomorrow. That's the plan. And 
yeah. And actually right now, like I'm sitting up and I'm not dizzy, but I just can't pull myself together enough to do a video while I'm on this necklace thing. And you guys, when I say I am like oversensitive to medicine, I am like extremely oversensitive sensitive to medicines. That's why I don't take like um, anxiety meds. They did some weird things to me. I don't take um, anything really. Like anything I've ever taken besides an antibiotic or ibuprofen always gives me these odd side effects, okay? Well, meclizine doesn't really necessarily give me an odd side effect, but it's, but I am one that gets sleepy even though, let me look on here. I'm pretty positive it says it's non drowsy. Hang on. If I can even read it. I'm, the lighting is terrible. My dad has this condition also, and he, he had it um, a few days ago, and he was at work. My mom had to go get him because he was vomiting. He couldn't even hold his head up, and he his was gone the next day too. And he actually went to the doctor and got some patches to go behind his ears that help would help with his, but he gets it like to the extreme, like, which I, I have in the past, but the... For the most part, I don't get it that bad where I can't even, like, um, move without vomiting. And that's what he was doing. Like, he could not even hold his head up. Okay, so the directions say adults and children 12 years and older tablets 2 to 4 capsules da once daily. Yeah, um, if I were to take two... I would not be awake at all. Mm -mm. And I've had to in the past because if it gets to the point where, like, I can't see to go to the bathroom because I'm too dizzy to walk, then that's when I have to take two. But as of right now, I've only taken one, and I'm already this much out of it. So, if I take, if I took two, I, it will knock me flat out. It does my dad the same way. So, yeah, it doesn't say anything on there about non-drowsy. And I just, for some reason, thought that it was a non-drowsy one. Dramamine knocks me out, too. And... But it says can make you drowsy on the bottle of it. I thought this did too, but it doesn't say anything either way. So, I don't know. But it has to because, you guys, I cannot even hardly, like, keep my eyes open. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I just wanted to get on here and update you guys and let y'all know why I'm not filming a video right now. And you can probably see the circles underneath my eyes. I'm so, so tired because when I woke up at 2, mm -mm, there was no like, going back to sleep because I felt too bad. And then... That medicine probably kicked in about, about 7 a.m. or so, and I, I could not keep my eyes open. So, I just want to apologize to you guys. Things come up. Things happen. But I do have an unboxing coming up for soon, and I have both of those right here on the end of my dresser, and I'll do the giveaway at that time. And hopefully, maybe tonight, this medicine will wear off, and I will not be dizzy, and I can get on there and do it, but... I can't promise that because honestly, I just do not have any idea. Like, I never know how it's going to work out, how long it's going to last or anything. It's It sucks when it's viral because you cannot do anything but wing it out. You guys, you can't. Even if I were to go get a steroid, like, that's just not going to take it away. It's only just going to help it drain out of my ear. Like, it's not going to help me immediately, you know. But, yeah, I mean... But the, again, I've been living with this since I was 17 years old, and I always get it when my allergies get to the point where they're really bad, and I and and it, and it just stops up in my ears. It does. So I just wanted to let you guys know, and hopefully I will be better tonight, if not tomorrow. And I'm seeing my finger in the video. I know, but I'm barely hanging in, you guys. I really am. Like this is all I can do just to get on here. But I did. I told you guys I was going to do something. I'm not going to not get on here and let you know why. I'm not. So, with that being said, I hope you guys all have a great morning, day, evening, or time, whatever it is you're watching this. And for me, it's a um, not so good of a day, but hopefully it will be better later on. And I will talk to you guys soon with my video. Bye.